Hey peeps, Phoenix here, we're continuing on with Earthbound. In the last episode, we explored, well, re-explored the lands of Magicant. And, well, we learned we had to be here because what the heck is going on? Excellent, excellent, everything for is planned. Dr. Adonis, Mr. Sam, and I worked together. And finally completed the phase disorder. The purpose of the device is enable instantaneous travel. Though space and time in this prototype, you can only travel to different points. With the same period. It's able, it is able, however, to search out the locations of enemies. Right now it's indicating the presence of enemies in Lost Underworld. Wait, what? Okay. I'm not sure what'll happen, but I set the big time trouble ahead for you. I'm gonna stay here for a while and help Mr. Saturn. It's important for a man to enjoy doing his duty. Ha, <laughs> the Mr. Saturns are incredible folk. And the Apple Kid, he is the most exceptional young man. Very different from the other kids. Well, anyway, the prototype phase has been stolen. So resembling a pig wearing clothes took Mr. Sutton captive and stole the device. So... So, let's see if we can get this thing going then. Okay, that failed. Work. One thing is missing, but that one material cannot normally be found on the Earth. The material I'm thinking of came from a meteorite. That fell when I was much younger. Have you seen a meteorite anywhere recently? A while ago. Eureka, that's it! With even just a piece of the meteorite, I can synthesize the material Zexanite. I doubt that your mortal enemy, Gygus, or whatever, will allow you to go to Onet and get a piece of the meteorite. By now, Onet is in his evil hands. You must go, though, so take every possible precaution. The Mr. Saturn have introduced some of their new development at the shop. Please check them out before you leave. I wonder what Onet is like at this point in time. Um, well, we'll find out once we check out the shop, like he said, because if I remember, these guys get some really good stuff. Oh, right, I forgot. Um, I want to give this to Paula, yes. Or maybe Jeff. Jeff might be better used for it. Eh. Let's see what it does with Paula, and then we'll go from there. I'll give it to Paula. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh wait, doesn't Pooh have something for um, Rain Panda and Paula? No. All right. All right, shop man. Make no thing. Must make daddy boing. You wait 30 minutes, Dom. You come here to wait 30 minutes, no? Subboing, you have 380 draw. We take ticket up. Subboing, you have 1780. We take it all right. Oh, you guys aren't the shop. Is this the shop? No, this is the hotel. This the shop? No, that's the hospital. Where's the shop? Am I being really stupid at where's the shop? Oh, oh wait, is this it? Here we go. Um, you don't have anything new. Okay, I need to sell a few things first off. You're good. You need to sell your flame pendant. Yes, we will sell some things that Pooh is holding, like the rain pendant. Then you, ooh, you have nothing. Okay, 
Okay, Blue, do you have anything else we need to sell? Eh, we actually could use the healing stuff, so we're good. What about you? Ah, yes, so... Here we can buy the pendants that we just sold, but we're pretty much good. However, do you have any, like, healing, like, point of life or anything? No. Alright, well... One of the main things I want to do is I need to go to a place where I can get some more multi-bottle rockets. Trust me, they're going to be useful. I just got to remember where we can find them. Uh, let's see, it would have to be in one of the later areas. Would the underworld have- no, no. Tinder Village, no. Deep Darkness, maybe? Trust me, you want to get at least a couple. Yeah, we should have a bottle rocket salesman here. Yep, there he is! Alright, I need a couple of these bad boys. I need to sell Jeff's baddest beam if I could. Nope. Alright, well, what about the other gun? Death Ray. There we go. Yes, and we will buy that other bottle rocket. Alright, we're good. Let me get to a good teleport spot. And we are out of here to Onet to see the disaster that's happening over there. Um, why is it night time? Well, doesn't this just look lively? Everyone's holed up in their houses. And I'm going the wrong way. This must be Onet. Surprisingly, we haven't come across any enemies. That's really shocking. So yeah, we actually have enemies around here now. Uh, if I remember right, we want to get rid of the evil eye first. Because I think it can diamondize. <laughs> We haven't seen diamondization yet, and I'm surprised, but it is not fun. Ah. Come on, Ness, we just got you a good bat. You shouldn't be missing. check to see how mom's doing. Hello? Oh, nurse, you finally showed up! There are plenty of creepy monsters running around on it now. The townspeople are barricaded in their homes, afraid to go out. I'm fine, but I'm a bit scared. Everything will be okay if we just sit here quietly in the dark. Are you hungry? Do you want to eat some pasta? Sure. Are you more relaxed? Okay. Okay, Mom, we're gonna go kill some things. Oh, what? If it wasn't because I had to see what all of them are... Oh, no. Ghosts of Starmen are not nice by any stretch. Because they know Starstorm! No! I don't know if this is gonna do much. Okay. Uh oh.
That's an all 87 offense by one, defense by two, guts by one, vitality by one, IQ by one, luck by one, HP by 15, and that rocks. People by 10. Okay, so everyone is paralyzed now, so let's fix that. Actually, wait. Yes, you have healing Omega. Perfect. Oh, that only works on one person. Shit. And for poo. Then we will heal up. Moving on! Nah. Please, not another one. Oh. Oh, well, we have enough PSI to do this. gotta make our way to where it all started. Hopefully we don't have to put up with the, many more of those guys. Please, not again. Okay, this is more doable. Ah, crap! Well, I wished for it and it happened. So yeah, while their health and everything stay the same, they're basically dead. See? But I'll heal her once we get to a safe spot. Thankfully, Pooh has Omega. Okay, let's try to cheat this out a little bit. Just one, I can take it. Why are you so fast? Pooh's all 76. Oh, baby! Offense by 6. Oh, baby! Defense by 3. Guess by 2. Vitality by 2. IQ by 1. Sweet! HP by 26. PP by 3. Almost there. Oh, nothing's gonna stop us. Cool. There's something shiny that you can reach. Do you wanna... Yes! Awesome! So now we can go ahead and head back to the professors. Can we do that right here? With a shot. Okay, professors, we got your thing. Hmm, if I only had the piece of... Oh, right. The whole thing where you gotta go into this and get... Yada, yada, yada. I'm thinking of some... I want to go get a few things before I go. Because he said that 1780 for... Who's the one that told us the price? Or wait, can we just buy them in the store? Because it'd be best to get a few revival items. Yeah, okay, let's get, like, three. Two will be good because I remember we want to take a few pickups. We've been saving these, so we might as well get them. Uh, let's see. 
Bag of Dragonite. Um, is that it? Yeah, I guess the Bag of Dragonite's really all we need. Just for safety. One more horn of life. <clears throat> okay, so we're all set to go. And then let us trade some things around. Give one of these to Paula, even though she already has one. Give one of these to Pooh. And give one of these to Jeff. Is what I would like to say, but I guess let's deal with it. Alright, so now we wait for our delivery. Alrighty. Oh, yes, this is fantastic! What? Well, I've never actually seen these incredibly rare elements before. It is very intriguing. All right, leave everything to us, and you get some rest. This is going to be most fascinating. All right, we'll do as you say and go to the hotel for a night. Finally, it's complete! The Phase of Zota version 2. It's equipped with two new features. First, you can repair your biological functions. Second, you can save your progress. Don't be afraid, get this in. There is just one thing though. You might not be able to return, so make sure you are optimally outfitted. Are you ready to go? Yep. Even if you are not 100%, perfectly, completely ready. Well, you should be as prepared as possible. It will be for the best. Without careful preparation, you will be in big trouble. I just want to make sure you're ready. Let me know when your preparations are complete. They are! Good! At last, the time has come. Are you ready? Remember the phase assault of version 2. It's equipped with two new features. First, you can repay- Yes, 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 you told us this. Don't be afraid, get that in. Cool, it works! Okay, we're back in the real creep zone. Oh. Hey! Greetings! So you are finally here! Excellent! You are truly excellent! There's only a little time left, and I'll give you the last power! I must go now! And Pooh now knows Starstorm Omega! Oh, this place gives me chills. Kidnapped, I was, boing. Kidnapper, bad guy. Bad guy gone. Zoom. Where? To the past. Ding ding. Good to know. Uh. How are we? Oh! The phase of order has been completed. We should finish it quickly because of Mr. Saturn's incredibly scientific skills. I guess is attacking from our exact location. But he is attacking for many years in the past. So what are we supposed to do? This is very hard for me to tell you, but... You must walk to the past and fight, mate. Eh? We hit the point. What's going on? Um... An old book to defeat, I guess, who is attacking from the past. You must walk to the past. This can be done by the way of the phase of sort of three. However, the machine cannot warp living things. I mean life forms. Life is demolished in the process of warping. The only way to accomplish its time travel is to transfer your brain program into a robot. And send the robot to the past. The transfer means that your spirit will go with the robot, while your body is left behind. You cannot promise that your spirit will come back after the battle in the past. Yet, you must understand that these four of you are the chosen ones. Do 
you still wish to face Gygus by traveling to the past? Well, we don't really got a choice. Hmm, you accept this while knowing that you may not be able to return to your current form, right? Yeah. Yes, I see. You have really set your mind on this. Let me take a good look at you now. Yes. Please give me that red cap. Ready? Stand by. Oh, here comes a really disturbing scene of the game. Yes, Paula, Pooh, Jeff, my son. There is no turning back now. Yes, activate the face to Zoto 3 by your own hand, thereby following your own destiny. Will you do so? Only a few people know of your amazing courage, but the number of people you save through the bravery is immense. I feel very fortunate to be present at the beginning of the mon monumental undertaking. It's about to take one heck of a turn, guys. From funny... ...to what the hell. Welcome... ...to what the hell town. And we start with the back attack, of course. Oh no. Alright, well that's one down. Oh, I don't want to kill this guy because he explodes. Balls in all 80, offense by 2, defense by 1, speed by 2, guts by 2, vitality by 1, HQ by 1, HQ by 15, PP by 5, Jeff's all 78, HP by 3. Oh, fine, it's just 1. Okay, squatter demons now. Because we are in one heck of a messed up place. How do you get poisoned as a robot? Well, I guess we'll take care of that. Oh, back attack. Oh, goody. You know what? I'm out. I'm not gonna fight this one. Bad enough that it's a star, but it's even worse when it's the Exploder. Okay, can we do this without getting poisoned this time? Well, it's not a huge deal, it still sucked. up with this place I don't know what is up with the music and I don't know why it's in this game all I know is that it still gives me the creeps every time I play it because again this game was all lighthearted and funny and smiles and then we go here and it's all terrifying and nightmares and what do we got in here Ooh, a legendary bat sweet Okay, so long as it's not the exploding guys, I'm willing to fight them. 
Thank you. I mean, it's annoying if you got poison, but dodging is even better. Okay, I'm gonna try and dodge these at. Oh. Well, seems we got teleporting orbs. Butterfly, what are you doing here? Not happening. You can go ahead and keep doing that. Not happening. Butterfly, I'll save you, buddy. You stay with me, little buddy. We'll get through this together. That does not look good. Oh, and I gotta fight since it's a new guy. Oh, final Starman, I know you got something bad with you. I just cannot remember what it is. So let's get a shield up. I guess a heavy bazooka. And we can show off Omega. I knew he had a shield! Oh crap, he's gonna blow up. Oh, thank you. WHY DID YOU DO THAT?! Oh. Did we kill it? Thank you. Pooh is just barely hanging on. Okay, as long as we can get Pooh all healed up. Nice. Oh. oh, those final starmen are not nice. Not nice at all. Yeah, I can do that trick with these. Although I think I just made it worse. Can we not? Thank you. I really don't like those healers that explode. That is the main reason I'm not fighting these battles. Oh, if I don't run away from this, it's gonna hurt. Thank you. Alright. Well. This is what we came to do. Although there was an enemy we didn't see. That's that's kind of unfortunate. Um, I'll show what it is in the title card. It's basically another Kraken, and it does have a rare drop that's an ultimate item. However, seeing as we didn't even see, you can guess how well rare it is. But, uh... I don't even know what to say about this place. 